to another cup of capo. Now I'm standing in front of Jamaica High School, which was my old alma mater. Where is it? In Jamaica, Queens. That makes sense. Now today's cup of capo has to do with sometimes you have to look at the past to know what you need to do in the future. You can take accountability of your whole life and go, well, let's see. I graduated high school. I graduated college. You think about all the things that you've done. Now I actually used to climb up these steps to go to school, but did I climb the steps? No, I didn't. I actually would climb up this part here and run up. Why? Because I still had an adventurer in me back then. And sometimes even on weekends, because I actually lived right down that block. I only lived uh, like two minutes from the school. Uh, On the weekends, I would actually hop the fence. I taught my son how to hop a fence when the gate was closed. Uh, And there was a... uh, park right over there, Goose Pond Park, where a lot of the kids used to uh, cut, and which wasn't good because the dean would always go into the park and he would find them, but luckily I was one of those goody two-shoe students saying, never missed a day, had perfect attendance, I, dean's list, and what can I tell you? Anyway, I like to go for perfection, not that I always get it, but anyway, the point is sometimes you have to look at the past to know where you need to go in the future, say, I did this, did that work? Yes. And I did this, did that work? No. Okay. I'll do some of this, some of that, and you can move forward. Fran Capo, know what you did to know where you got to go. Now, right now, I got to go on to my next meeting. So much for high school.